With a daring spirit and a penchant for the unpredictable. Are you playing the hyper I'm blind. I'm blind in a heart attack. These unexpected escapades not only entertained, but also piqued the curiosity of the police. I suspect that you have been drinking tonight. This is my last time asking you. I need you to get out of the vehicle now. My father is the president of... Look, at this point, at this point, you're, you're, under, arrest. you're under arrest for obstruction. Here are the instances weaving a tapestry of unforgettable moments. Beginning with this audacious law student who dared to outsmart the law, a perilous game of cat and mouse ensued. Brace yourself for the thrilling saga of intellect pitted against authority. Why You're gonna keep your hands at Why am I taking a, a, a drug test? Now, so when we're speaking to you because of all those stuff, we smelled a little bit of alcohol, an alcoholic beverage. On April 20th, 2024, officers were investigating a case and noticed a car speeding past them in New Mexico. Curious and concerned, they decided to check it out. Detecting the strong smell of alcohol emanating from the vehicle, the officer commanded the driver to exit and ask some questions. Desperate to evade the situation, the female used excuses, ultimately claiming she was too cold to comply. Turn out the vehicle, please. Go ahead and step out of the vehicle, ma'am. Um, for what? Go ahead and step out of the vehicle. Do I need to get my license out or anything? Yes, I need. Oh my god, what is that? Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm... What are they doing? Why did you... Oh my god. Do you guys need to get out of the car? Come speak to me over here. What just came from my friend's house? Do we need to get out the car? I need to speak to you. Why? It's super cold. No, oh my god, no. Oh my god, it's super cold. We just came from my friend's house. Where's your friend's house? Oh, we need to take pictures. We, we, were take things, we were taking pictures. You were taking pictures? Okay, so what's going on today, Mom? Um, I don't know what you're stopping me for. We were just parked. So, we had a shots fired here. Okay, I don't know anything about that. Okay, so... Okay, so why are you blaming it on me? You're getting no me out anybody. of my car. No, so I You're getting me out of my car where I was safe. You're bringing me out in the open. Why are you doing that? So we just want to figure out what's going on. Okay, I don't know what's going on. Why are you taking out of my car? I don't know anything. My friend lives here. I don't know anything where you're going to ask or anything. I bought some shots. You said some shots, right? Shots fired? Is that what you said? That's, just, that's what I said. I don't know anything about that. I want to get back in my car. It's super cold. I don't know why you're getting me out of my car. Okay, have you been drinking today? No. No? No, I want to get back in my car. It's super cold. Stand by. Eddie? Sir, wait, what's your badge number? 995. I'm sorry, wait, can you come real quick? Give me your card real quick, because I don't have your card number. Card your number. card? Yeah, you have a card where it's supposed to be your badge number? Yes, I'm telling you my badge number. It's no, you can give it to me. You don't have to give it to me. You can give it to me physically. Okay. So where is it? So stand by one. Yeah, sir. That's a first Sir, so you, you're getting me out of my car? Yes, because we had a shots fired sir, here. Sir Fagin, okay, I don't know anything about no shots fired. You're getting me out of my car. Yes. My car. I can I give you my right license so. plate and I can get you my driver's license or anything, but I don't have anything to do with it. You're getting out of my car, disturbing my peace. So correct, I gave you a lawful order to step out of your vehicle. All right, and, and I complied to her, right? Yes. Okay, so, so can what I get it back in my car? Because it's super cold. Okay, well, stand by one more. If you're not getting me your card, physically, your physical card, you're not getting, you're not giving it to me. Yes, I'll get you a card. Oh, but you need can to stand you give by. it to me? No, sir, please. I want to get back in my car. So am I detained? So have you, have you been drinking, ma'am? No, I haven't been drinking. I've told you no. Okay, am we I detained? observed you driving. Yeah, and I was driving okay. good. Huh? SFSC? And I was driving good, and we were getting back of my friend's car. And Would we were... you be willing to submit to some sobriety? Filters? Sir, I was driving good. What is your reason for pulling me over? I was parked. Well, we observed you driving. We saw you go Sir, this and way. Sir, and I did a U-turn here in a law for neighborhood, and I did a U-turn in a law for neighborhood. Would you be willing to submit to some sobriety? Sir, why tests? are you pulling me over? For what? I'm super cold. You're pulling me over for a law for for a law. After persistently asking whether the female was willing to take field sobriety tests, she attempted to outsmart the officer. Please? Would you be willing to submit this? Sir, I need your physical part, your card, please. Sir, I need your physical card, please. 
So are you refusing to take this? No, I'm not refusing, test? sir. I didn't say no. Okay, so are you willing to submit to some <laughs> Sir, I need your test? physical card, please. So the card is irrelevant at the moment? No, the it's not I'm because you? I was parked. Sir, okay. I'm a law student. I was parked. Yes, and I yes, observed you driving erratically parked, while we're conducting our investigation. And I was not driving And you even parked crooked in front of the residence. Sir. So are you willing to submit to these sir, sobriety tests? if you come tests? over here. Go ahead and put it, your things here. Okay, if you come over here. Look, come over here real quick. Hold on, ma'am. I'm asking you one last time. I'm are not you willing refusing. To I'm not refusing. Are you I'm not refusing, okay. though. This is a yes or no question. I'm not I'm, refusing. I'm going to ask you one more time. Are you willing to submit to field sobriety tests? I'm not yes refusing. Or no? I'm not refusing. It's a yes or no question. I'm not refusing. I'm not refusing. <sighs> no, ma'am. You weren't pre-gaming? No, ma'am. We were just refusing taking pictures. We were you refusing. were refusing taking pictures? You're yeah. Making sense. We were taking pictures. You're telling me where we came from? We're telling you we were refusing okay. taking pictures. So if pictures. I go to the Neon Amador and I get video footage, I'm not going to see you there? Right. Okay. Why'd you drive out and then come back? Because she lives here. Who lives here? Uh, my friend. I know, but you went... <sighs> Ma'am, am I being us? arrested? He asked you a question, you're not Am answering. I being arrested? I'm asking you a question. Are you going to do SFSTs or am not? Am I being arrested? Are you doing SFSTs or not? Am I being and arrested? And I'll let you know. Ma'am, I'm a law student. Am I, I being arrested? I don't care what you are. That's not my problem. I'm I not know, asking you what you are. I'm, I'm asking you, are you willing to submit? It's a yes or no. I'm not refusing. You're not forced to? It's a yes or no. I'm not refusing. So you are willing to do them? I'm not refusing. Is that are a yes you or no? Are you... Am I under arrest? And for what reason? Because right I now? drove under the parking lot, miss, but it wasn't nothing illegal. You drove what? I'm, I'm authorized to do a U-turn no, here in a parking lot. Parking. No, you're not. I'm not? No. You're not? I'm not? No. And what section? What section of the you law? You can't do a U-turn What section of the, of the law am I not refused to do a U-turn? Okay, Ma'am, I'm asking you what Stop section of the law. Last chance. This is your last chance. Are you willing to submit? I don't need I'm an telling I'm you, I'm not, not refusing. Yes I'm not. asking you what what section of the law am I not I'll show you illegal right now to when do we give a you the citations, okay? Okay, ma'am, give me the, 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 the citations, will be there. but I'm not refusing. And how you're parked too, okay? So all those it citations will be there. Ma'am, look. Yes. <laughs> am I not illegally parked? Why yes, am you I, are. How am I Vehicles illegally parked? over here are supposed to face that way. Can you Vehicles point that way real quick, real quick? Because... Get out of the road, you can get hit. Ma'am, ma'am, you're you're further than, than me. I'm not gonna get hit. Coming you're, towards the roadway. I'm not gonna get get hit. You're telling okay. me that I'm getting pulled over because how uh, I'm it's parked. Um, ma'am, you, you know what? Can I get your badge driving? number it's and your card? No, no, no. I want your and, physical um, card and I want your physical it's card. It's nine nine eight. Okay? I want your you're physical camera, card. You're set. you're authorized um, to get your physical card, ma'am. I don't think you know that I'm a law student. I don't care what you are. Okay. I need your physical card. You're authorized to carry to carry your physical card. I need your cards. I mean, okay, you don't get near me because you're gonna get to assault. Ma'am, you're characterized to okay. carry your physical card okay. in case okay, of emergency. So we're gonna ask you one last time. So depending refusing, on your answer, I'm that's not what's gonna happen. I'm not okay. refusing. Despite the woman's shivering and struggle against the cold, the police proceeded with the standardized test. However, the cold proved to be a bigger obstacle than the law, as she demonstrated. For the first test, go ahead and place your feet together, like so. Go ahead and place your hands at your side. So now look at the tip of my pen, using your eyes. Go ahead and look at the tip of my pen. So now, with your eyes and your eyes only, follow the tip of my pen, okay? So okay. don't turn your head. It is super cold, so I want you guys, I want to warn you guys that. Okay. It is super cold. Yeah, I got Okay, so just follow the tip of my pen. Okay? Yes, sir. Do you know that? So just your eyes and your eyes only, okay? Do you know that thing at all? No. Okay. So just your eyes. Oh, it's super cold. So I need you to focus, Ram, okay? I'm sorry, it's super cold. No, I'm not refusing, but it's super cold. Okay, ready? Mm, it's super cold, officer. I need you to focus on these tests, okay? Yeah, but I want you to know that it's super, super cold. I understand that. And there's no reason for you to pull me over. Okay, ma'am. Focus, okay? Hands, feet, feet together. Oh, it's super cold, officer. I know, ma'am. 
The sooner we get this done, the sooner What we is get your name and badge number? I told you already. Can you tell me again, please? Officer Bagan. Officer Bagan? Bagan, 995. Oh, it's super cold, officer. Uh uh. There's no reason you should be pulling me over if okay. I was parked. No! Alright, ma'am, so for this next test, can you imagine a straight line? I believe so. I could maybe if it's not if it wasn't super cold. Here, actually, uh, so just, please don't and, get close to me. Go ahead and face this please way. Please do not get close to me. Just so you're not walking in the street. Okay, so can you go ahead and imagine a straight I line? I'm walking in the street. No matter what happens, I just know it's just so not, you're not walking into traffic. I just want you to know that it's super cold and it's not. As the test continued, the females' escalating arguments with the cops reached a breaking point, leading to serious consequences, with her response markedly different from previous interactions. And I'm explaining it to you, however, you're refusing to and listen. I no, I do not refuse to listen. This, I, I hope you know I can conduct, I hope you guys can tell me what I'm pulling, why you, why, why you guys are pulling me over for. So ma'am, if you let me speak and you listen, I'll I'm go sorry, ahead and explain it to you. super, super cold. Okay, so... So reason we pulled you over is we're conducting an investigation here on a shots fired. A shots fired? Ma'am, can you let me you speak? Told her okay. Yeah, but you said shots fired? Yes. Okay. I told you twice already. When did that happen already? Okay, ma'am. So let's just focus on our test. <laughs> so imagine a straight line. On this straight line, you're going to place your right foot. <sighs> on front of your right foot, you're going to place your left foot like so. Okay, well, Hands I at can your try side. Because it's can you super, get in the position, please? Super cold. I can try because it's super cold. I don't need you to officer try. Officer and officer. I can try because it's super cold. So I can try for you. Okay, so get in the position. <sighs> and what position you want me to? That one right there where you're making? So place your right foot on the line. Okay. And then your left foot in front of your right foot, like so. Like that? Yes. And then place your hands at your side. Right there. <laughs> it's super cold. Like that? Officer, like that? So, right foot, oh right foot on the line, place you, and then your left foot in front of your right foot, like so. Oh my goodness. And then it's hands at your cold. side. Why You're going to keep your hands at your Why am I taking a, 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 a drug test? Don't argue. We're not going to argue, ma'am. You Just literally listen. said you weren't going to refuse. That's no, I'm not refusing, point, but you guys are you not telling me. It, you, you guys are telling me that you're pulling me over because of a U turn? You can't. Um, go ahead and turn around. Ma'am, you're being placed under arrest for driving while under the influence of intoxicating alcohol and or liquor. Can I please have you use your... It's going to be all in the paperwork that you're going to be provided, okay? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Do you have a jacket in there? No, ma'am. It's super cold. <laughs> I'll be right with you, okay? I want my water in the car. I can't get my water in the car? No. At all? Nope. <laughs> So why are you guys placing me under arrest again? We already went to like a thousand times. Which you, we you, you can tell me again. Clearly you're not understanding what I'm saying. I you am understanding. It it's times. super cold. It's Usually super when cold. people are drunk, they don't not. understand. But I'm super cold. Okay, I'll be warm in there. Go on, take a seat, ma'am. I'll turn the heater for you. Sir, please. I'm super cold. Huh? The police collected information from the passenger and read the suspect her Miranda rights. The officer also requested permission to retrieve her license from the vehicle, but her inaccurate response complicated the situation. Does she have a license? For her? Mm-hmm. Oh, let me. Um, so I guess she was leaving from another place. Uh, she hit a car. There's damage there. So right now I got the address where they were at. Yeah. So there's going to be a car that's hit over there. Yeah. Um, so uh, also a hit and run. If you want to go ask her right now, just uh, um, if you want to just start knowing Miranda here and then ask her about it, and then after, What's I'll your go name? over there. Oh my God! You guys okay. don't have any heat in here, please. So much. Yes, ma yes, sir. You guys don't have any heat in here. So just listen. To me, okay? okay, 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 okay. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you while you're being questioned. 
If you cannot afford a higher lawyer, one will be appointed to you to represent you before any questioning, if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any of my questions or make any statements. Do you understand these rights as I explain them to you, Ms. Okay, so Ms. I'm going to ask you questions regarding the vehicle accident okay, and the damage in front of your I vehicle. I don't know anything about it and I, like, look, you guys are super hot in here. Like, I cannot believe you guys have people in here. No, I cannot believe you guys have people in here. Do you guys have people in here? No, so, It's super, super hot. Please. It's hot? Yes. So, Ms. I don't know anything about that vehicle accident. I don't know anything about that vehicle accident. And the damage what, to your vehicle in the front, on the right side. Where? The damage your vehicle sustained on the front right light. Right now? It happened right now? No. When did it happen? Well, that's why I'm asking you. Can I see it? So, not at this time because you're detained, ma'am. I just wanted to see if So, were... why am I detained, sir? I don't understand. Well, you're not detained. You're under arrest right now for driving while intoxicated. But, but how do you... I'm asking you questions pertaining to the vehicle accident that you had earlier while you guys were at that little carnival downtown. Carnival? Or wherever you were prior to this. I don't know. Okay. I don't know, but I don't know why I'm under detained. You're placed under arrest for driving while intoxicated. But I'm asking uh, you questions pertaining to the vehicle accident that you got into prior to being under arrest. I know, but I don't know why you guys aren't um, detaining me for that um, particular reason. I don't for know. For driving mm -hmm. while intoxicated. Mm -hmm. That's a crime in the state of New Mexico. But I wasn't anything. No. You guys didn't do any sobriety tests or anything. Do you not remember what we just did? Well, yeah, but I asked you why, and you guys didn't and even complete it. But you guys didn't complete it. You guys at, you guys told me that you guys were into it, and then you guys proceeded to tell me that I was under arrest, but I never really got the reason why I was under arrest. You guys just told me you guys were doing sobriety tests on me, but I never got the reason why I asked you. Okay, and then follow up questions. May I get you the driver's license that's in your purse, in your vehicle? Uh, no, you may not. I can get it for you if you'd like. Okay, well, we'll tell this female officer to bring your purse to you so you can get your, uh... But I don't know why I'm under detained if I'm under the, the influence, but I never got tested or anything, and then... Well, we were doing our tests, and you were being so argumentative that No, we were I was to asking questions, because I'm a law student. I want to ask questions. I was asking questions. So there's a time and place for questions, ma'am, and there's a time for listening, which you were just unwilling to do, and you were willing I to argue with me during the entire time I was trying to conduct my SFSTs. Now, I'm not here to argue with you at the moment. We're not well, arguing. My question is, I want to ask you, can this female officer bring your purse to you so I can get your driver's license so we can go ahead and proceed with the paperwork? Um, I can get it for you, if that's what you're asking. I can get my driver's license for you. I'm not arguing with okay, you. Okay, may we have permission to get in your vehicle and get your uh, purse to No, you, you may not. I can get it for you if you'd like. Okay. Go ahead and sit back. No, you can sit back inside. But I wouldn't prefer you close the vehicle. I'm very, very, it's hard to breathe. Um, so if are you, you can hot keep or it cold? open, um, super hot. So if okay. you can keep it I'll open, you I can't leave the door open for you, mom. Do you think Policy. you could put down the window for me? Yes, if you'd I, could like. put, I could put down the window. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. To conduct the final test, the officer escorted the woman to the station and explained the procedures. However, the woman only seemed to make things difficult, leading to another argument. <laughs>
After all the opportunities the officer offered, the woman failed to understand, prompting the officer to proceed with legal action. So the reason why you were stopped is because you did that U-turn, you passed by us, you did that U-turn, and then you also parked on the wrong side of the road. No, so I that's can't. when we spoke to you. But I can park there in that park of the road. It's a neighborhood. It's not a road. It's a neighborhood. Like it's yeah. not like I've made a wrong So we turn. smelled. So when we we're speaking to you, because of all those stuff, we smelled a little bit of alcohol, an alcoholic beverage, and that's why the officer did. You guys didn't protest. tell me that though. You did, officer. You. The officers did. Okay. No, you they the didn't. Tell me that, oh, officer. Officer Gomez is that Sar Sergeant Gomez? Yes. Sergeant Gomez, they did. Tell me that though, that, I, that they smelled alcohol in my breath. They didn't tell me that. You can run the cameras back. Okay. They didn't even let me conduct the whole. <laughs> Officer. It's what right. am I going to be here like though? I want to go home. So you still need to see a judge? Oh, this early in the morning? Not till Monday. Not till Monday, but you're gonna keep locked up till Monday. You're not gonna be here. Okay, so I'll ask you, when am I gonna get released? That's what I'm asking you. So after you hear a judge, man. Or a judge hears you. Come on, let's follow my Bro, it's a big me. I can't take a photo like Maestro. Official, I want to be a lawyer. I want to be a lawyer. I want to be a defense attorney. I can't be a lawyer like this. Come on, let's go. Let's go. I'm asking you something. I can't be a lawyer like this. You made the decision. We did. I did it. I was not in the influence. I was not in the influence. Okay, Ms. Palma, come on. The female was charged with aggravated DUI. When the night took a turn, law enforcement found themselves dealing with this unforgettable character, a tipsy woman who made quite the scene. Do not start until, you, until I tell you to do so. Do you understand the direction so far? Huh? It's, it's okay. No one's, no one's watching. It's just us. 
Okay. On June 25th, 2023, the officer responded to a disturbance report involving a man and a woman in Maryland. The law enforcers interacted with the victim and the detaining officer explained what he discovered. However, this was just the beginning, with further details to investigate. Got him, he's off. Double lock. Gotcha, I got him. Pretty easy. Alright, you just wanna lift your arms up. Best you can, I should have double locked these so I don't get any touch. Gotcha. Alright. Alright, what's going on? A lot of fighting. Yeah, why? Let's go. Like, she's beating it on my face. Okay. You see my face, right? Let me take a look at it. Try to take your father. She, he's in Wildwood Cemetery. You try to. Yes. Oh. Yes. Okay. This is the night of his. Um, I don't even know what to say about it. Okay, so what, what, what caused what caused the issue tonight? Like, what what, what caused well, the fighting? Well, because I want to take him to his her father's. Okay. Yeah. It's, it's like. So you guys got into an argument about taking. It was yes. is it remains yeah. like ashes? No, it's not ashes. It's just. <sighs> just in general, is he passed away? Me and him were like best friends. Okay. Ever. Like I was crying at the. With her about taking her to him. Okay. It was like it was like a like I can't even explain it to you. Okay. I mean, there's 35 cops out here. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It was like <sighs> I just want to listen to her. <clears throat> no. It's she can't even get a word out right now. She's having an anxiety attack. She says she doesn't want rescue or anything. But I'm just giving her a minute to collect herself. Okay. This vehicle initially didn't have its hazards on. And I wasn't up the west of it yet. That's why I started passing it. But my window was down. And I heard her screaming, stop, you're hurting me. Whatever. And I looked in. You can see the angle in my car. And I could see him leaning over. And he had hold of her head or neck, something like that. Okay. So that's when I jumped out. I radioed out. And I just got him out of the car and okay. cuffed him. All right, so so I was trying to talk to her. Just to get a story. But she's... I want, I want just need a okay. All right. Huh? That's her. Let her go. Yeah. With her father. All right, we're just... Listen, we're just trying to figure out everything going on right no, now, okay? It's, it's, it's me. It's me. Okay. It's me. You hear me? Both I, of you. I, I'm listening to you. Listen, okay. we're just trying to hit, hit, hear I everything. Want, yeah, I want her to go home okay. with her father. Her father lived them all her life. And they, she died. He died like two years ago. Okay, and me and him were like best buds, but we were at the, we were at the cold night long, or all day long, mm -hmm. and we were drinking. Yeah. I want her to go, like we were. So you guys were, when did this arguing start happening? The argument started like 20 minutes before you arrested me. Okay. So you guys pulled over on the side of the road yeah. and started arguing? Yeah. Okay. I don't want, I don't want nothing, to, I want me to go. Okay. Let her go, let her go. I want to go. Okay. Things get physical between you guys? No, no, no. Yeah, physical, yeah. You see my face? <laughs> I, that's all I'm trying to see there. No, that's fine. Yeah, I don't care about that. I don't want that. <coughs> see that? We're, we're in exactly. Like, can you describe where you're... I have no idea, but it hurt. Like, the bottom of my face. On the side of your face right yeah, here? Yeah, she got me. Yeah. I don't care about that. I don't want nothing to do with that. Let her go. Let her go. Just let me... Let her go. Okay. We're just trying to figure out. I don't want out, nothing. Okay? I don't want no problems. Did they with see that. anything? But her friend. Did they see anything? All right, just hang on with. Me. The woman had an angry attitude and kept causing problems with the cops' investigation. So they tried putting her in the vehicle and gave her a few minutes to calm down. Did it help? You're like, this hey, is hey, funny. Hey, 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 calm down. Are you laughing? Hey, 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 h
Yeah, Lane's probably got him. I hear him laughing. Over. It's not huh? funny. I got angry. Can you just make that? Can you sit in there for me, please? Just because you jumped out, I don't want you to go around. Because anymore. when I hear him laughing, it pisses me off. He told me he's going to think he's in my dad. Listen like, to me. I told you. You say, ha ha ha. Listen, like, ha ha ha. I don't, don't give even a shit. I don't give a shit if it was him laughing. It was somebody else. Not even I know that laugh. Okay. Come on. Like, if your friends were laughing, you know that laugh. Like, I Just hang tight here, okay? I'm just gonna this is what I did in the corner because he That's okay. made me That's nervous, okay. so I said, like, get out. Okay. okay. Listen, just let him be. It's not, it's not funny. It's not funny, but it's not It's not worth it, okay? Just, it's not funny. Okay, just let him. He's, be, he's gonna be He's gonna be gone in a couple minutes here. Why oh, is it funny? It's not funny. I don't know why he's laughing. Okay? At the corner from there, yeah. I said, get the f out, I'm driving, it's not funny no more, and then he took my hair and banged me up the steering wheel, so like, why are you laughing? It's not funny. He told me he was taking me to say, find my dad, which is a veteran cemetery, mm -hmm. so why is it funny? No. Please. This is Ocean City, right? Yep. Yeah, okay. Thank you. But yeah, this is Ocean City. Can I City. shut that door? I can shut it. Yeah, no, I can do it. He's got it. Can I get out? Just, just hang on the car real quick. Can I? We'll, we'll get you out of the car in a second. We're just going to wait for him. Can I stand right here? Okay. For like just, air or something? You got the window down. It'll just, just, it'll be a couple more minutes and he's going to be gone and we'll get you out of the car. Because of the woman's panic attack, the police approached her gently. However, she appeared distressed about something at home and requested her phone to contact them. I'm sorry. I have anxiety. All right, I understand. I'm not a, like, a schizophrenic or a retarded. Or... Do you have cameras? Cameras on? Yeah. yeah we have so all... I look like a... No, 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 no you don't. Basic. No. Like, none of these cameras don't go anywhere, okay. so. My brother's in. A... Okay. Yeah, we'll take we'll take a look. So it's probably in the car. We'll find it. I'm just saying, I'm not a schizophrenic. I'm not. A, I was just hyperventilating because I don't ever have to deal with things. Because I get nervous. Can I look for my phone? Hey, if you want, color your phone. It's black. Like, it's not in your bag there. Here, just stay in the car for us, though. I'm not gonna pull I, I, anything. I know, I know. I just want you to stay in the car for right now. Okay. Yeah, well, you're, you're, full, you're right there on the seat, car. No, that's that's his. Does he need that? Is he a Well, it's probably his property. Two or two central. You want this one? Two or two. That's his. Okay, give me two. I think we just found this one. Just one in custody. You can take one. You know, wallet or anything, though? Where do you think you can want mine? Okay, we're, we're gonna go out here and go over the sidewalk in a second, okay? We're just waiting for this car to get out of the way. I'll be taking a one with one, star mileage, four, two, four, four, five. 2142. We're gonna, we're gonna do it on the sidewalk. Sorry, so. Yeah, we're gonna do it right here. Okay, all right, you good to hop out? 25 Central, motor vehicle stop, 1800 block west. All right, we're gonna go stand right over here on the sidewalk, okay? Sure. Yep. Shut your door. All right. You wanna come over here? Just stand up on the sidewalk over here? Okay, listen, I'm just gonna perform a couple of tests just to make sure that you're good to drive, okay? Can I ask a question? Sure. Before you record? Did you ask him where is my phone? We'll look for your phone. He my didn't have- My son has my Okay. We'll, we'll take a look for your phone. He didn't have your phone on him. Where's we asked. How old's your son and where's he at? He is nine. Where's he at? Home. Where's home? With my 16 year old. Where's that at? South of the Where is it? Purple. Are they in Ocean City though? No. So it's Purple. just you two in Ocean City? Yes. Who's home with them? My son. The 16 year old's watching the 9 year old? Yes. Okay. 
The officer explained the field sobriety test to the woman. However, her agitated mental state made it challenging for her to focus. Despite the officer's reassurances, her anxiety continued to interfere with her ability to follow the instructions accurately. Is he in the car? Did he throw it? We'll take a look for your phone. We'll find your phone. Are you should sit here. Are you guys going to be assholes to me? No. We just got to we just got to perform we a couple tests. We should sit here. You guys are mean. Okay. Listen, we we got to perform a couple tests. I can look around. Yeah, just just stand right here on the sidewalk for us, okay? So Remember I told you we were going to get you home, all right? Before we can do that, because you did tell me that you were worried about him driving and, you know, and you're drinking and you were worried about yourself. We do have to make sure that you're okay. No, 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 no trouble. But we do have to make sure, we have to do our due diligence to make sure that you're okay before you're to drive away. Does that make sense? No, I don't really know my feelings, so I'm not really okay. Well, we'll get your phone, it's not a big deal. But, so, um, between myself and Officer Diggins, we're going to do a couple of exercises with you, just to make sure that you're okay to drive, and then we can get you out of here, okay? So I'm going to start by checking your eyes, is that alright? Alright, so, do you have, um, epilepsy? Are you epileptic at all? No? Okay, if you don't know what I mean, I went to Catholic school, but I don't really know, like, the... That's okay. Are you on the lot? No? Okay. Can you do me a favor and just step right over here with me? Can you just stay right here? Can you just put your arm down to your side for Okay. Do you see the tip of this pen light here? What color is that? It is red, right? Okay. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this pen light side to side very quickly, and then I'm going to slow down. Okay. Any minute? It's okay. I'm sorry. That's okay. Yeah. yeah. There's no rush. Okay. <laughs> No, I know. We, we talked about that. It's no problem. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to just explain this to you while you're breathing, okay? Is that all right? I already know it. It's all right. All right. I'm going to move. It's me and my breathing. You don't have to explain your... I understand your tools. It's me and my breathing. Okay. It's not you. No, no. It's me being no, but me. I, I need to explain to you what I'm going to do so you understand, okay? So I'm going to move this, this pen light side to side. I'm yep. going to be kind of close to your face. I'm going to start pretty quickly. And then I'm going to slow down. And then I'm actually going to stop and hold it in certain positions. So while I do that, what I need you to do is follow it with your eyes and your eyes only. You're not going to move your head at all. Okay, you understand that? Okay. So go ahead and let me tip of this pen light. Remember to follow with your eyes and your eyes only. Follow with your eyes and your eyes open. Yep. And look at me. I need you to follow with your eyes only. Don't move your head around. Do you understand that? I know. It's okay. I'm not an idiot. I'm home. I just have an idea. Follow with your eyes only. Don't move your head. You're turning your head on my energy. Follow this up. 2149. You see the light? Follow it up. Follow it up. Now what I'm going to do is circle your face and come in close, but I'm not going to touch you, okay? Just follow the light. The second police officer stepped in to conduct the walk and turn test, ensuring clarity in each instruction as he demonstrated the procedure. The woman's performance left the officer completely speechless. All right, the first one's gonna be the walk and the turn. Um, I'm gonna read off this card, I'm gonna explain your instructions, I'm gonna demonstrate, and then you're gonna perform the test. You understand? Okay. Um, so you're gonna put your left foot on the line, 
you can imagine you can just use the imaginary line. Um, it's a flat side walk, so just imaginary imagine a line. Um, put your left foot on the line and put your right foot in front of it. <clears throat> Touching heel to toe, and keep your hands to your side, just like this. Okay? You can get in that position now. Um, you understand? So you can have, go ahead and put your left foot and then your right foot in front, just like this, so your hands are your side, you can get in that position. Okay? So you gotta put your right foot in front of your left foot. Can you do that for me? Yep. Your hands are on your side. And you're just gonna stay there until I explain the directions. <clears throat> when I tell you to begin, take nine heel to toe steps, turn, keeping one foot on the line, and return nine heel to toe steps, just like this. Okay, I'm gonna demonstrate. I'm, a, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna demonstrate. I'm gonna only do three. When you do the test, you're gonna do nine. Okay? I have to count to nine. You're gonna count to nine. I'm gonna only count to three just to demonstrate the test. Okay? I'm gonna step back. You count to three, I count to nine. I'm just demonstrating. I'm not doing the whole entire test. You're going to count to nine. I'm only going to do three just to demonstrate to explain the test for you. Take a minute to breathe. Let me know when you're ready. I don't know why. I'm... Okay. All right. Ready? You're going to put your left foot down. My phone? Right, we'll look for your phone in a minute, okay? You're going to put your left foot down. What do you want me to do? All right. You're going to start with your left foot. You're going to put it on an imaginary line. Yeah. You're going to put your right foot in front of your left foot. Just like that. You're going to mm -hmm. keep your hands down your sides just like this. It's a episode of cops. Alright. Ready? Okay. You got your left foot, right foot in front of your left foot, hands on your sides, okay? <clears throat> you're not starting until I tell you to do so. Do you understand the directions so far? Okay. When I tell you to begin, you're going to take nine, he nine heel to toe steps on the line, turn around keeping one foot on the line, and return nine heel to toe steps back. I'm, I'm explaining it to you. Okay? Mm -hmm. Do you understand so far? You gotta get in that, that starting position. Okay? Your left foot in front of your right, right foot in front of your left foot. Can you do that for me? I'm explaining it to you. Okay? Let me know when you're ready. Over. Do you want me to put your right. foot in front of me? Make me like, Is that what I'm going to do? No, I'm, I, do you want me to explain it again? Okay. My left foot in front of my foot. Yes, you're gonna put your left foot in front of your right foot. I, I, I'm explaining it to you. Just you ready? Okay. You're gonna put your left foot in front of your right foot. Go ahead. Put your right foot in front of your left foot. Heel to toe. Put your arms down your sides. Go ahead and put your right foot in front of your left foot. Yep. There you go. Okay. <clears throat> do not start until you until I tell you to do so. Do you understand the directions so far? Huh? This is so it's, embarrassing. It's okay. No one's no one's watching. It's just us. Okay? You're gonna take I nine. You do anything. How does a girl who gets her hair <coughs> smashed against a windshield get embarrassed like this? You wanna try to do the what test? Do I, I'm, I'm trying to explain it. I'm trying to explain the test you to you. You want to pull my hair too? Uh, Go ahead. No, I'm trying to do this test with you to make sure you're okay to drive. I'm, I'm trying to get the test done with. You ready? Okay. So you're gonna put your left foot on the line. You're gonna put your right foot in front. Arms down your sides. I can't do it. You know I can't. Okay. What do you want me to do? You okay. know I can't do it. You want me to do this, 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 okay. this. Okay, hang on. Okay, yeah, yeah, hang on. All right, we're gonna try to perform it's a different. Ocean City. Like, okay. It's a all right, listen, listen. The officer proceeded to the next test, the one leg stand, detailing its importance while the woman continued discussing another matter. Her lack of attention quickly sparked a bitter confrontation, intensifying the already charged atmosphere. All right. Don't tell me to say my ABCs backwards. Huh? What? No, no, we're not, we're not, not going to make you sing your ABCs school, backwards. I do not no. know how to do that. Okay. Um, stand with your heels together and your arms at your sides, just like this. Like a like this? I'm not standing like that, just stand like this. Okay. Do not begin the test until I tell you to do so. Do you understand? Just, just pay attention to the test. Just pay attention to the test. Okay. Hold on. What? Did you find my phone yet? We'll, we'll look for it. Don't worry about your phone right now. We're. All right. 
when I tell you to, I want you to raise one leg, either leg, approximately six inches off the ground, foot pointed out, keep both legs straight, keep your eyes on the elevated foot. Do you understand that so far? While holding that position, count out loud, one, one thousand, one, one thousand, two, one, one thousand, three, and so forth until I, until total stop. Okay? I'm going to demonstrate. So you're going to pick whatever foot of your choosing, you're going to hold it out six inches, you're going to point it straight, and you're going to look at it. One, one thousand, one, one thousand, two, one, one thousand, three, one, one thousand, four, until it's told to stop. Okay? Do you understand the instructions? I do. you have any medical conditions that would refrain you from doing this type of test? I mean... No. Okay. I'm not trying to make it bigger than it is, but... Okay. So do you understand the test? Are you ready to begin? I understand. Okay. All right, you can begin. Pick, pick whatever foot of your choosing. Panic attack, no. Okay. Panic attack, they cannot hold their heart rate when they're panicking where their son is texting their phone and you can't find their phone. Okay. Remember, you got to count out loud. I you say that. Hmm? What'd you say? Do you want to begin the test? Do you remember the instructions? I don't know. Your light was 30 seconds late. Okay. Do you remember the instructions for the test? Hold your foot up high. Yep. You're going to hold your foot six inches out, toe pointed. You're going to look down on your foot. You're going to count 1 1001, 1 1002, 1 1003, and so on until I tell you to stop. Do you understand? Okay. You ready? All right. You can begin. Your hands behind your back. All right, you're being arrested right now for driving while intoxicated. As the cop checked the woman's handcuffs, another officer found the mobile phone she had requested, encouraging her to comply more effectively with the officer's commands. Who's he home with? How old is he, Isha? My son is 16. Okay. Crazy. And he's with my nine-year-old. Okay, but he doesn't you know, have okay. special needs or anything like that. Right? They're okay by themselves right now. I texted him when we were leaving. I said, we're on the way home. I was saying bye to Papa, which is my dad. I okay. said, sorry, where he was supposed to take me before he banged my head on this. And I only took the wheel, the red light right here because he... Yeah. Yes, okay. thank you. Right, that's my... On. No, that's my son's. Okay. Yeah, well, well, once we get back to the station, we'll have you reach out to him. Let, let him know what's going on. Alrighty. Where you going? Huh? You go back. Yeah, this car right over here. Right, we're going to walk over to here just watch, watch this curb. Right is my car going to get towed or is it okay? It is. Yeah. No! I don't have any money to... Can you guys park it where it doesn't get towed? I'm a single mom with three kids. Please, can you park it where it doesn't we'll, get towed? We'll do. Watch your step. Watch your step. Oh. We'll do what we can. Right here. Can you guys please park it where it doesn't get towed? I don't have any money. Alright, ready? I'm gonna help you. Up. No, I'm gonna start over. Huh? I'm gonna start over. Okay. Okay. I'm just gonna reach over and I'm gonna buckle you up, okay? I just see the right over here. What up? Sorry, I failed your test. Is my yeah. car gonna get towed? That's not mine. It just fell off of you. That is you not know. mine. Okay. You can the 29 potential what it tells you. Roger, I'm already making money down there. Didn't just come off <laughs> Yeah, well, probably from him yanking on her head. <laughs> so I don't know what you want to do with that. Um, I mean, you want an evidence bag? If you want evidence, we'll just take a picture of it. I'll ask her. Do you want your, your purse or anything out of your car? I got your phone, but do you want your purse? Do you mind? Yeah, you want your purse? I can bring it back with us. It's the brown one and okay. um, the passenger side. Okay. Thank yeah, you. the the brown purse. And that one with my son? Yep, I'll, I'll, I'll put it I'll put it with your phone, okay? Thank you. Yep. I'm sorry. It's on the phone. Yeah. Thank okay. you. Yep. For finding you. All right. 
You just want to hang on to that and hop in. Are you coming back with me? Yeah. All right. Bye. Crazy. We're good here. Door. Your door's still open. We'll figure that out when we get back to the hall. We'll get back to our police department, okay? After arriving at the station, the female officer conducted a pat down to check for any suspicious items before proceeding to the next step. Hey, were you good to go come back? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yep. There you go. Yeah, we're good. Just hit the unlock button for me. I think you still got the keys. Just enough. Yeah, you can hit the unlock button on the door. Now. Hit the lock button. Alright, I'm gonna take the buckle off, okay? This way. Just watch your step. You do know you guys have drug addicts. Like, people that okay. are bum wall. Hookers, prostitutes. Okay. Watch your step right here. Shut that. Yo, put her in the step board. I don't know. Yeah, I know. Well, I can still do that right now. What? I'm gonna take your cuffs off. Cuffs are still off. Okay. And you can pat it. Whatever. You're gonna pat her now. Cuffs are staying on. Before I got you done, do I make sure you're pointing at me? But she's staying in here for right now. She's staying here. You're going to start for 20 minutes. She has no watch on or anything? No. No, no I won't. No, I just checked on your basic mom. Oh, like, I, I have I, nothing. I understand. We just have I'm to check. I'm your it. basic mom. I understand. We have to check. You have so much more out there than me. I understand, but we have to. We have to. Okay. Right, yeah, you got to take your knows. cell phone now. Yeah. Cell phone, camera. provides a detailed explanation of the testing procedure, which includes mouth checks and machine tests, aiming to ensure the individual's safety. You're just gonna sit here. Okay, so here's the process. Have a seat, man. So here's here's the process, okay? You have to sit here, open up your mouth real quick. Open up your mouth, stick out your tongue. We just gotta make sure nothing's in there. Uh, uh, I didn't like that. <laughs> open up your mouth. All the way. Okay, lift up your tongue. Okay. The machine's sensitive, so if you have like gum or something in your mouth, sometimes you lock up guys and they still have dead things of like that. Okay, so listen, I'm going to explain to you how it's going to go. We're going to have to watch you for 20 minutes. Okay, by that time the machine will be ready. We'll bring you in. We'll get the algo test machine to test your blood alcohol. Okay, once we get two two um, qualified tests. Then we'll bring you back in here, take your handcuffs off you, do some paperwork, let you make a phone call. What's up? Stay behind you. Are your shoulders okay? Or? 
Well, I had surgery on my okay, right side. Okay, you're a second, second set of cops. Here, here's the. Okay. I have pins on my right side. No. Here, you use mine. For the, uh, Yours are behind the desk. Go grab them. I have pins on my right side. Okay. I'm going to give you. From softball. Yeah. What position do you play in softball? I, um, second in the center. Okay. And I, I busted my right so listen, side. Listen. It's a state police machine. They, they ultimately own the machine. Okay. So we gotta leave. I'm not playing you. Like, no, 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 no
Right. I do know he pulled my hair, like grabbed me, and was like slamming me down. So that's where I said, "Get the f out!" And then when I, and then, and then like in minutes, you guys were there. Mm -hmm. So now, I think that's why I got more uh, anxiety. Like I just freak out over yeah. the little things. Like and then like it's not towards you guys doing your job and like respect you guys doing your job. You know, making the world safe. Like it's not that. It's just more, I panicked of, oh my god, I'm f***ing and I felt like I just sat in the seat. I think that was more it, like, oh my god, I'm in trouble, and I just sat down here, because I knew I couldn't let him drive, because mm -hmm. I don't know. No, okay. I don't know. And he just got me, he's like, mm -hmm. Okay. Um... Mm -hmm. So he was, I mean, he was arrested for the simple assault on you because he, what he did. Um, He's not have you guys, me like do that. you guys, have you guys, do you guys have a history of domestic violence? Um, like, have the police been called to your house before? Not really. Have you had I think maybe once. Okay. While the woman waited for her mother, she found the place uncomfortable and uninviting. Breaking the law never results in sweet or comfortable consequences. It's just something we have to do when, I mean, like I said, you got arrested for DUI, and that's just our, our protocol that when somebody gets arrested for DUI, you have to. And it's that not something. Go against me? What do, you, what do you mean against you? Like, are you going to file DUI? Hmm? Like, are you going to file a DUI against you, me? You got arrested for DUI. So then it's going to go against me? That's why you're here. But, like my sergeant was saying, it's not the end of the world. It's just. Oh, it is. It's, it's, it's a no, big. No, I'll lose my job. I don't think you'll lose your job. Yeah. Oh. Questions, okay? I'm typing up the report and. Huh? Alright, well, I just, I just need your kids. Why am I still in here? What, what do you mean? Why am I in this box? We're, we're running into a couple issues, but this is where you're going to What gonna issue? It's... You told me, like, I'm either out or you're booking me. Like, why am I still this in is this box? This is considered booking right now. This is, is this your... little hole? This is... The cell's worse. The cell's even smaller. It's probably half the size. Yeah, but I'd rather lay down okay. than feel... Okay. Well, unfortunately, that's not where we're at right now, okay? You so nowhere. That's why we were trying to have your mom come pick you up earlier and it wouldn't have this problem, she but wouldn't. okay, well that's where we're at right now. Um, what takes so long? What's your kids, I need your kids' information. Why? Because I need to put it in our report. Why? Because I, because you told me about them and I, I they're didn't. They're not involved. I know they're not involved, but I, you mentioned that they're home alone and I just needed to put they're it in our report. Alone. They are home alone. No, they're not. Okay, I need, I, I just need your kids' information. No, because huh. then you're going to blow that up. It's, so it's literally just... I, it literally just puts it in the report. No, because it, no. And then we get a court on this and you're going to blow that into another story. It literally is just a name field. I just put their names into the report. What? All right, I just want to explain your ticket to you, okay? Because there's a court date on here, which is an important court date. Um, I sent you a court date of, um, you might not have your court hearing that day, but you have to contact the court before that date. Um, all right. That's, so, to contact the court, Any, all this information on the back, you can call them, um, but you, you have to call them before that date, okay? Just that you might have to do a first appearance, you might have to show up to court, um, but just make sure you contact them before that date. The man was charged with simple assault. The woman received a citation for DUI. What happens when illness complicates legal matters? Dive into the case of this woman, whose health issues played a pivotal role that she couldn't avoid. You have, slur you have slurred speech. You have difficulty in comprehending what we're saying to you. You don't recall being behind the wheel of the car at the time of the accident. Ma'am, I'm advising you now you're going to be placed under arrest. We're asking you to step, step out of the car, please. Okay? On May 22nd, 2024, an officer responded to an accident report in New Jersey where one vehicle hit another from behind. Upon arriving at the scene of a car accident, the police engaged with the woman, ensuring her well-being and assessing for any potential injuries. However, she became emotional, so he tried to find out more about the reason. Hello, how are you? Good. What's going on? I don't know. I'm just trying to go through the light and just kind of swipe the back of it. Okay, it happened. 
of course, right here like this. So what happened? You were at the light here, and this vehicle hit you in the butt, in the rear? Okay. Okay, no problem. Hello. Hello, ma'am, are you okay? No. What's wrong? Alright, give me a second. Can you cut the car off? MC4. MC4, okay. Anybody work at Phil Sobriety? Oh, you can stay in the car for now. Stay in the car. Two and two. I am not so surprised. Stay in the car. Stay in the car. I stand by two and two. You have your license, registration, uh, and insurance card? Uh, one away. Uh, swing over there and review two and two. Two and two. We'll see you on I'm at uh, 1021 uh, Jackson. Just want to bring that car over. Alright. No, that's your, that's your um, health insurance card. 913, you received that search? Okay. 913, You have registration and insurance? It's real, make your way down there. It's real. I'm trying. We just keep that. Got it. So I'm gonna ask you a question, ma'am. Have you had anything to drink today? Yes. You have? How long ago? Uh, six hours. About six hours ago? What were you drinking, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, wine. Wine? We're at home or at a bar? Where, where were you? Wine at home. Wine at home? Okay. Okay. All right. What's wrong? Why are you crying? Why are you crying? Yes. Hi, three oh going out. There's no need to cry. No need to cry. Are you hurt? The cop saw the woman holding her chest and having trouble breathing. Recognizing her distress, he tried to calm her down while another officer quickly searched for medicine to help her. All right, no need to cry, okay? You're not hurt. They're not hurt. An accident happened, okay? Um. Is the insurance card in your glove compartment, ma'am? Yes. Are you, can you, are you able to get it out? You put everything on the seat already. Maybe it's on the seat. Right there, Jeff. Okay, here you go, ma'am. What's wrong? You having difficulty breathing? Uh, 84. I, I, I have. I'm going to have an ambulance check you out, okay? 34, make your way to Newark and Jackson. See the unit there. 
on an NBA chapter one. Everything from the chef on I received that. I, 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 I don't. Hmm? I don't. Need. So being that you're holding your chest and you're, you're having difficulty breathing, I had a I mean, I'm just come to check I, you out. I, 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 I have. First. She has asthma. Okay. Can I check to see if there's an inhaler in here? Sure. I, I have asthma. Mom's. And I also have. Uh, Alright, the driver of this vehicle may be having an asthma attack. Reese. Breathe. Breathe. Mama, we need to breathe. We need to breathe. Give that to Mil give that to your Miller. Just send it all to me. I'll take care of it. Thank you. Come on, mom, mom, mom. Stop. Breathe. You need to stay calm and you need to breathe. Breathe. Thirteen and twenty. Driving a vehicle, uh, maybe maybe a little intoxicated, but she's having difficulty breathing, and uh, she's holding her chest, like she's having chest pains. Okay. When the paramedics arrived, they checked on the woman's health condition and offered comfort, understanding how stressed she was because of what had happened. Let me know what you think about everything else. Maybe if you see. What do we got? What are we looking at? What you said? I didn't talk to her. Uh, no, I, on, on that part I did. But if you believe... Where is she, where is she going? If you believe I'm based on your initial observations that yeah. she may have been, this is the reason you called me in the first place, mm -hmm. then you can go based off that. Mm -hmm. um, because we can't... No, not our, now. the current condition, give her tests. Right. Can you tell me your name? God forbid she... I, I, I understand. Has she been this combative all the time? That's the case. I can't hear you. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Has she been like this, like combative and disagreeing the whole time? Or? Mm, not so much. Not really. Can you tell me your name? Is she? I mean, like, she's slurred. Are you thinking maybe she had a couple you know of. Yeah, she's slurred her words. Slurring speech, right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, she doesn't want us to do nothing. But she's holding her heart and having an asthma attack. So if she doesn't want nothing done, then. Yeah. Well, I'm just saying. I, I get you. No, 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 no. I, don't, I, don't, I don't mean like. On uh, her uh, half, though. We try to get her medical attention first. Yeah, no, no. I'm just saying she's. I didn't know if she was being disagreement with you guys. No, 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 no. She. It's I requested because she was sitting here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I got you. I'm having asthma, so. If she's not, then she's got to perform. I don't. I don't mean like. I know what yeah, you mean. No, no problem. No need to explain. Yeah, I appreciate it, though. Yeah. No. Thank you, brother. Is that her daughter? Or? Thanks, guys. Yes, that's her yeah, daughter. That's a Slurred speech, no reactions. Yeah. I asked her for her uh, insurance card, driver's license. She gave me her health health card. Okay. Yeah, she was definitely not alone. Hmm? She was definitely not alone. She's alert, but not alone. Nope. Alright. So, Miss, you don't want the ambulance here to uh, assess you? You don't want to deal with them? Ma'am, Alpha Breakaway, I'm going to find this lady 215 9th Street. Room 207 for the child having a seizure. Ma'am, I recommend you come with us. 215 9th Room 207. Check that out. Daniels is from 111. Right, so I got that. It's the favorite individual. I got you. Thanks, Dumas. We have to hear yeah, this. so we got yeah, that. He's having a She said she has a history of alcoholism. She had a, a history of alcoholism? Yeah, okay. Um, aside from one, the asthma, and she just had COVID. So, 
the only reason I could think why she would be Okay, no problem. So she doesn't want to die, that's all right. Right, yeah, so, uh, yeah we also got that. So, I mean, so, uh, it's up to you really if you're comfortable with her driving out of here. No, she's definitely we not having that. that. No that's definitely available not available. Uh, we're not even, we're way past that. All right, yeah, that's kind yeah. of what I figured. No, yeah, 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 we're uh, way past that. So, her daughter, it seems like she's willing to, like, She's going to be one taking the car. Yep. Okay. All, All right. right. So, Sarge. 115. After addressing the immediate situation, the officer expressed concerns and asked the woman to perform sobriety tests. But she responded by becoming uncooperative. Hi, ma'am. Hi, I'm Officer Melanie. I'm one of the DUI experts. I was wondering if you'd be willing to take a few tests with me just to measure your level of intoxication. No. Okay, can you just step out of the car with me, please? No. Well, I'm going to need you. If you want to perform the test, you need to step out of the car. I am not willing to. You don't want to take the tests? Essentially, the tests are for me to judge your level of intoxication. You could pass the test and be considered safe to drive, if that's the case. I'm not driving. You're behind the wheel of a car. You got into a motor vehicle accident. I have not done. Ma'am, you were involved in a motor vehicle accident. It's concerning to me now that you don't recall that as you're behind the wheel of a motor vehicle. My, my only job here is to try and determine your level of intoxication. There's three tests that need to be performed if you're willing to take, take those tests. And I have not done the deal. Okay, so I want you to understand that if you don't take the test, we're going to go strictly based on our current observations. You have, slur, you have slurred speech. You have difficulty in comprehending what we're saying to you. You don't recall being behind the wheel of the car at the time of the accident. It's very concerning. I have not been in... Okay, ma'am. Well, if you're not willing to take the test, then my partner's going to go strictly based on his observations. Okay? And as I said, slurred speech... <laughs> Difficulty to form sentences coherently. <laughs> but being behind the wheel of an accident at the time, you don't remember the time. I have not been in the wheel of a car. Okay, ma'am. Again, you're having a hard time performing simple sentences. I'm asking you to step out, perform the test with me, so that we can determine where you're at exactly. When have I been in? Okay. Well, are you again? I'm going to give you one last opportunity to perform these tests. When have I been in... Would you mind doing just an eye test for me from the seated position? No. You don't want to do that. From the comfort of your own chair, you're not willing to take the, the eye test. I would Can you just check your eyes? I just want to check your eyes. It's a, it's a quick test. I'm going to take a pen and just go back and forth with it just to see where your eyes are at. Why? Because I have to judge if you're, if you're impaired or not based on my expertise. Expertise. Yes, ma'am. I'm a certified DUI officer with the state of New Jersey for the last four years. Okay? I'm simply here to do my job. Okay? Your job is to... Uh, Before you say anything, I want you to make sure you remember, remind you that you are being recorded at the moment. Okay? Before you say anything else. It's all evidentiary. And I have not been... Exactly. Man, this is our point. You can't perform simple sentences. Your speech is slurred. You don't recall being behind the wheel of the, at the time of the accident. Based on that, it's... What it's, accident? Okay. Yeah, I think she's, she's a 2-5. She's yeah. not going to perform a test. Even though the officer tried to help and the woman didn't want to take the test, the officer told her she was being detained, making sure to keep everyone safe and fulfill their responsibilities. Can you please step out of the car, ma'am? No. All right. Hi, ma'am. I'm advising you now, you're going to be placed under arrest. We're asking you to step, step out of the car, please. Okay? Take my hand and come out of the car. Why? You're being placed under arrest for driving while intoxicated. It's very simple. I ask you to perform tests and you refuse to take those tests. You cannot perform clear, coherent sentences. Your speech is slurred. You're behind the wheel of an accident. Behind the wheel of the car at the time of the accident, you do not recall. So please, let me take your hand and just guide you out, please. What? What? Yeah. No. What? Please, ma'am. Help. Let me help you, please. 
No, you're not helping me. Man, regardless, you're going to have to get out of the wheel and end up behind the seat at some point. You have to step out of the car. Please. Man, this is putting us in a very dangerous situation. We have cars yeah. that are her, her name is driving name is past Christine. us. Christine? We no longer Christine. want to be in the street. Can you please step out of the car so we can go onto the sidewalk, please? Why? So we, can, so we can get onto the sidewalk. We're standing in the middle of the street with cars driving behind us. I'm unable to watch the traffic because I have to watch you. So, ma'am. Please step out of the car so we can just walk over to the sidewalk. Why are you doing this? Please. Why are you doing this? You finished this? talking on the sidewalk. Why? 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 Christine, please. No. Why are you doing this? Ma'am, we're not doing anything to you. We have a job to do. Yes. Please step out. Yes, you do. Okay. Please. Why are you doing this? Can you step out of the car so we can have this conversation on the sidewalk? Yes. This is a very dangerous situation for myself and these officers. Can you please just... Let's go to the sidewalk, please. Do you need we'll, a hand? We'll help you out so you don't fall, okay? Go ahead. No, I don't want you to. Okay, you. Why are you doing this? You can do it on your own power. Let's step Why? Up. Please. Why? Why? Man, we are now in oncoming Why? traffic. We need to go. Why? 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 Please. Why? Please, come with us. Why? Please. Just come with us, please. Come on, walk. <laughs> Uh, wait, 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 leave it open. Yeah, check it. Yeah, check it. You got this? Alright, man. Why? Why? Come over here, come over here, come over here. Come Why? Why? Come Thank you. No problem. Over here, please. Okay, at this time, I need you to place your hands behind your back, okay? Stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up for us. Stay up. Stay up. Uh, in the middle of the street. Does MTC 14 have a cage, Joe? Yeah. Okay. All right, just step inside of our car, okay? Step your, step your left foot first. Ready? Left, left foot first, please. Ma'am, step your left foot in first, please. I help you guys. I help you guys. The woman was charged with DWI and refusing to submit to a chemical test. Caught in the wrong place at the wrong time. Witness the unfolding drama of this driver's encounter in a handicapped zone, where every moment counts in the compelling investigation. So you need to step out of the car? No. Come on, ma'am. Come on, miss. Come on now. Just come on, come on, miss. Just relax. Just relax. Let's step wait, a minute, wait a minute. Just relax. Just relax. Just relax. On December 12, 2023, the officer noticed a vehicle parked in a handicapped zone at a gas station in Palm Beach County. The officer asked for the woman's documents after noticing her unusual behavior, which raised suspicion. Ma'am. Hi. Hello. Can I get your license registration, proof insurance, please? Yeah. Okay. Um, may I ask why? Why? Because you're parked in a handicapped spot and I don't see a placard. Oh, but I just moved in here quickly. No time frame on the placard. Can I see your license, registration, proof of insurance? Sure. Um, 2 Bravo 98, final 20, 1201, 44th Street. So what are you stopping at the store for? Um, I just came in to get a pack of cigarettes. Just a pack of cigarettes? Yeah. Right. Who are you calling? Uh, I need your license first. My attorney. Your attorney? Okay, well this is just a simple traffic stop. Yeah, well so. he's also my boyfriend. Gotcha. Well, he can't help you right now until I get your license proof for insurance. That's your registration. Well, one thing at a time. I'm sorry? One thing at a time. No, I'm going to need your license and... 
Hello, this is Richard. He's currently unavailable. He's unavailable. So, ma'am, I'm going to ask you, please. You don't have to make it harder than it has to be. Did I do something wrong? Yeah, you parked in a handicapped spot without a placard. Where are you coming from? Just my house. Your house? Here. Okay. Yeah, and actually I was... Uh... Can I just get your license, please? One second. One second. Is there a problem? Yeah, there is. Pulling over or traffic stop for not having the placard. So, can I get your license and proof of insurance? You haven't given me that yet. Ma'am, we're gonna need your license. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have all of the above. Perfect, then, why don't you provide for me? Are you operating? Are you operating? Oh. What am I operating? Hey. What were you doing at your house before you came here? I was talking to my clients. Your clients? What do you do yeah. for? I'm a hairstylist and makeup artist. Oh, okay, cool. Nice. Yeah. I can artist it. What? Ma'am, can oh, I just wow. please get your license? You're making it a little harder than it has to be, and I don't want to do that, so. What's going on, Mr. White? The woman's lack of cooperation prompted the officers to take a different approach. When they discovered her license was suspended, the woman's attitude worsened, making the situation more difficult. Were you just getting cigarettes at the store? Be honest with me, what were you here for? Yes, I was getting cigarettes at just the cigarettes. store. Yes! Oh my god, do you think I was here for something else? Stop it. I don't know, what do you think I could Are you joking for? me right now? I'm not joking, I'm just asking you some questions. Uh, I am 100% here for all the cigarettes. Okay. What, what, did, what else did you think that I was here for? I don't know, that's why I'm asking. 1000% no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why do you guys think that I'm here for something else? Okay. She got on this word speech. I was a thousand percent nothing here for anything else. Would y'all stop? Oh. Yeah. Uh, what the heck? Okay. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, do you, uh, do you, on this word speech. I just uh, there was no people. other parking and everybody oh, else. Have you? Yeah. Has anybody seen the things that have happened to me? That's wrong. She still won't give me her uh, license and insurance. Okay. And I know they explain this to her. Just re explain to her where she's parked in the handicap park. Yeah, you you don't have a plaque. Yeah, you're parked in the handicap parking space and you don't have a plaque. So that's a violation. Yeah, that's a violation. So that's why you need a fine. That's why you need a license registration issue. Yeah, so I need your license registration. We got a female officer uh, that can come in for a pat yes. down. Yes. We got to get them started here. We're going to show you something, ma'am. Uh, okay. Request for a female to deputy to be 51 to attempt to vote. Right now, let's do it. Give it to me. Give it to me. I can. Yes, I can. I can't. I can't, ma'am. Yes, I can't, because you got to pay attention to what we're doing, okay? This is 
is not allowed. This you, is what's a not thousand a, percent not allowed. Here's a hundred thousand percent. You need to cooperate with the police when you commit a violation. So listen, you don't get to call your FBI friend, you get to listen to us. Oh my god. Do you have your license, registration, and insurance? I need it right now. Yes. Let hand it over, please. Please, ma'am. This is the I traffic would like stop. my phone back. Okay. Again. Oh you if you don't give me your license. What the heck? You parked in the handicap. Look straight ahead. This is for a look, handicap. Look, look straight ahead, ma'am. Trust your own. Trust this your, is for a handicap. Trust, oh, handicap. trust your own eyes. First of all, look at the violation. Like, look straight ahead. Reed, hold on. Oh, wow. Reed, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can call. Close the door. Hey, close, close the door. Ma'am, listen. Could you listen to me? What is going on look right now? Look straight ahead right there. What does that we'll say? Step back. Now, I do appreciate the cooperation. We didn't have to get off on this rocky start. We, we what, is it? what is it? This is really, this is the most appropriate thing. Thank you so much. Now, why, is, why, why is this happening? Okay, you need to talk. Where are you coming from? Sure. My house right on two on North Where are you going? Right back home. So I mean, why is this happening? Come? Yes. So why is this? Why is this happening? Out of all the things that happen in this neighborhood, look, why? Look right at that sign. That's why it's happening. Is, That's so, why we're here. Oh, is you this, look, let's remind all yourself. of this is necessary. Go ahead, I'll let you take. Go ahead and take. Go ahead and go right What's here. happening? Tell them what your suspicions are. Okay, ma'am. Ma'am, can you listen to me? Can you listen to me for a second? Okay. Right now, I'm suspecting you. Sure. That I suspect that you have been drinking tonight. I have I not. I can smell a strong odor coming from your person. Well, oh, I have not. And I need you to step out of the vehicle so we can, no. so we can do some tests. No, you I have not. I have not. I okay, have not. well, I smell a strong odor. So I'm going to need you to step out of the vehicle. I don't know why. Is it my, um, my perfume? Ma'am, I need you to step out of the vehicle. No. no I'm, I'm giving you a I'm lawful. Not. I'm not. I'm going to get out of the vehicle. Okay. No, because you know I what? Need, look, Taylor, my, this is my last okay. time asking you. I need you to get out of the vehicle now before I bring okay. you out of the vehicle. All right. You hey, know man. what? Thank you for that, but no. The officer also suspected the woman might be impaired due to a strong smell. Her refusal to cooperate resulted in an altercation with them. You know what? As my, my father is like the yeah. president, Brown. my Brown. father, Brown. my father Brown. is the president look, look, of. Look, at this point, at this point, you're, you're under arrest. You're, you're under arrest for obstruction, so right you need to step out of the car. No. Come on, ma'am. Come on. Come on, miss. Come on now. Just come on out. Come on, miss. Just relax. Just relax. Let's step wait a minute. Wait a minute. Just relax. Just relax. Just relax. Just relax. Just relax. Just relax. Wait, Come on, wait, 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 no. Don't need to what? What did I just do? Relax. Listen, listen. You're under arrest, man. For DUI and obstruction. There you go. Miss, come on now. She's on the She's on the She's two minutes ago. Okay. Alright, that's all. That's all. I feel like that's all. That's all. Thank you. You don't do you want to when they white female female Okay, okay, okay. Okay, all right, no problem. Yes, can we stop here? No, we're not going to. I would like to. That car, that car. Yeah, no, so I would like to stay here and like Yeah, well, you can stand here in front of me. I notice like what's going on in my car. Oh, she's running. Oh, she's running. Stay right here. You just stop talking. I just talk. I try talking to you, Hey, I've been in the body of all of us. Oh, I've done that. I don't know why anybody had to go down this way. Oh, my God, guys. You got that box. Can I drive by the number? I'm going to. Why did this have to happen? What happened? Mm -hmm. Why? I have my computer. Yeah. What did I do that yeah, was so it. wrong? Mm -hmm. What did I do that was so wrong? No, no, no. Before all that. You see, you see where your car is? That's a handicap sign. That's a handicap spot. You don't have a handicap sticker. Okay?
Alright, so what you got going on, man? So, alright, it's fine. Thanks, you got some My boyfriend. Um, alright. You need to listen to this deputy, okay? He's a state trooper. He's a state trooper. Ma'am? Ma'am. Ma'am. The female officer conducted a thorough search to ensure the woman wasn't concealing anything, explaining the consequences if anything was hidden, all while following standard procedures. Hello, ma'am. I'm with David Bell. Hi. I'm going to you? check you, okay? Make sure you don't have anything on you. Is that all right? Yeah. Okay, fine. turn around, face the car. Spread your feet, please. Do you have anything on you that may stick me? No? Yeah. Okay. You got piercings, like belly button piercings? No. No? Okay. My mom, please. Okay. Or please, my. Oh, wait. Oh, can you put them in my car? Yes, ma'am. In my middle console, yes, maybe? Yes, ma'am. Can I put my ear back in my thing? Oh, my God. No, you can't take that in the jail. You can't take that. Put it in your car as well, okay? You got any rings? No. Any, any bracelets? No. No watches? No. Okay. I'll put it in your car, okay? Thanks, but can we wait here for my mom and also has anybody called my mom? What is it? Once you are under arrest, so you have to follow the instructions. Because so I you don't create more charges. Well, we're oh. parking and the cab. That's to oh. initiate oh. the contact. We're going to have a seat in the car. Oh. Come, let's, let's have a seat. Careful, careful. Let's have a seat. Careful. I'm not, I'm not aggressive. No, I'm no, not nobody aggressive. say you are. Just have a seat. Watch your head stepping in. Watch your head. Watch your head. Go ahead, put your leg up, please. There you go. Thank you. Be careful. Watch your head. Can somebody put your other leg in, please? Put your other leg in. There you go. But put yourself I, in. I, I can you face have, forward? Wait, can I listen? Can, can you I, face forward? Can I have my mother come and get the car before my car gets We're, we're going to take, take care of it. We're going to take care of it. I don't want my car to get caught. The woman was charged with DUI, resisting without violence, driving on a suspended driving license, and parking in a handicap zone. Meet this fascinating man who orchestrated his daring escape from the law's grasp. Brace yourself for a story filled with dramatic twists and surprises. Your uh, driver's license is suspended for the violation of the 893. Was it September 1st that um, it got suspended or September It was 12th? August, I want to say it was August 3rd, so a little over a month ago. It just got suspended. Uh, Alright. So I'll, I'm just going to place you under arrest for the driving while license suspended. On September 13th, 2023, the officer noticed a vehicle with a suspicious driver in it, which prompted a thorough investigation. The officer approached the driver named Dylan, who seemed to be in some discomfort. Dylan mentioned the eyelashes in his eyes, but the officer didn't see anything visibly wrong, so she went for further investigation. Hi, how are you doing? My left eye has like 10 eyelashes in it. Are you okay? I'm okay. I, I was just trying to, I'm right around the corner. Yeah, I saw you. I just wanted to make sure you weren't having a medical emergency. Yeah, that you maybe were I should stop for a minute. Drifting and let within my, your lane. My left eye, like, opened back up. It was like. Do you need some medical? Do you need an ambulance? No, it's just. I'm pretty sure it's just, like, 10 eyelashes. 10 eyelashes? I oh, just, my gosh. If you want to look. Oh. Uh, is there eyelashes in there? Um. Without. No, I, I don't really see anything. Do your eyes usually roll back like that? Uh, I'm rolling it right now because oh. there's your eyelashes. I mean, what, are they going to try to tweeze your eyelashes out of my... 
I, can I just park for a minute and wait till my eye gets better? Yeah, give me just, yeah, if you want to okay. just stay here for now, let me see your driver's license real quick. I think it just, September 1st, it just got like, it like, just got expired, I think. Like expired? September 1st. Oh, okay. Is this your car? It's my girl's car. Okay. I can call her real quick. No problem. I just, I didn't know if uh, you had insurance information, but usually, you know, if it's not your car, a lot of people don't know. Um, it should be in the driver's compartment. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, give me just a second, okay? I'm if you want to look. I just... Yeah, it, it's, it's okay. Give me just a second. Yeah. The officer discovered that the driver's license was suspended, so she informed Dylan that he would be placed under arrest. At this point, his demeanor shifted from discomfort to anxiety. Dylan, Hold were on, you able I'll to? Put it on in a second. Yes, ma'am. Were you able to find everything? Yeah, here's the all the State Farm insurance. Okay. And stuff. Looks good. And then, I was, is you're you're not on speaker. I didn't put you on speaker yet. Did you want to talk to the car owner? No, no, that's okay. okay. I, I believe I you. I said I could put it in park and, and Yeah, if you can just uh, step out for me real quick. Yeah. Alright, the cigarette's going, so I put it out. Uh, yeah, if you want to just it. flick it or whatever you do. Well, I don't want to flick it. I like to litter. I like to try to pick up after people, too. After my yeah. Days, <laughs> I used to litter a little much. So oh. I actually pick up after people after seeing so much trash. Yeah, I know. It gets it kind of bad. Yeah, if you want to just cut it off, that's fine. Turn the lights off and stuff. Hey, Lauren, let me call you right back after I'm done. All right? Bye. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what she said. <laughs> If you want to just come to the front of my cruiser real quick, all right? Yeah. So your uh, driver's license is suspended for the violation of the 893. Was it September 1st that um, it got suspended or September It was 12th? August. I want to say it was August 3rd, so a little over a month ago. It just got suspended. Uh, all right. So I'll, I'm just going to place you under arrest for the driving while license suspended. Um, I'd uh, I'm going to take you back to the station because there's a few things I would like to talk to you about, okay? Uh, we will, I'm, I'm going to leave it parked here, um, and then if you want to call her when you get up to county, you can, but everything's going to just be left here. It won't get towed or impounded. Oh, wow. uh, just walk to the front of my cruiser right here. You don't have any any knives or needles in your pocket that's going to mm -hmm. poke or stick me. No, there, there might be a razor knife in this pocket. Okay. Dylan was charged with DUI and a suspended license when intoxication meets insanity. Follow the intense show of this man on a rampage, trying to sink his teeth into the law in a gripping clash. Okay, so throw so relax. Try to bite me one more time. Stop it! Stop it! Relax. Stop it. relax. Stop it. Can you pull the, can you pull the bed back? On March 1st, 2024, the officer from Alameda County received an emergency call about an accident involving Brian Goldberg. Hi, I'm calling to report an accident. Okay, where are we going? Uh, so I am right now on Alameda. That's on Alameda by the 101 North entrance. Right in front of the 101 North entrance. Okay, yeah. I know. Okay. Uh, is it a car accident? Yes, it's about three cars that were involved. A Prius, a blue Prius ran a red light. Were you involved, ma'am? No, I was not. I'm a, I, I saw it happening. So I stopped okay, to, to check on, on everybody. Is there any hazards, like wires down, cars on fire? No, no hazards, just uh, three vehicles involved. They are blocking some lanes. Okay, we're sending help. Stand the line for one second, hold on. APD, I'll take your numbers, please. All right. Uh, yes, sir, I'm 209, okay. incident 3382. Okay, I'm 178, incident 1146. Okay, sir, thank you. Right. Thanks. Central traffic units, ambulance traffic, Alameda and the 111 freeway. Alameda and the 111 freeway, code 3382, are you 119 central traffic unit to identify? Due to the chaotic situation, the officers swiftly detained Goldberg on suspicion and promptly took him to the hospital for a medical checkup. Hey, listen, buddy, I gotta handcuff you. I don't care what you have to say on this guy, I gotta do it. Turn around. Turn around for me. Okay. 
Putting two sets of handcuffs on you because you're a big guy. Because you're being detained for suspicion of driving under the influence of narcotics. Or possibly alcohol or a combination of both. We're going to figure that out, okay? All right. I'm not going in the car. I'm not going. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. No. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Wait, 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 wait. Ah! 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 At the hospital, Goldberg became aggressive and tried to get off the stretcher. The officers told him what to do, but he didn't listen, and things got messy. Help! Help me, please! Ryan, relax. Hey. Hey. Look, if you don't get cooperative, all right, your mom's not gonna come, your friend's who's in the lobby right now. Help me! She's gonna be, you know, we don't want to concern her, right? Okay, okay. So, okay. so, throw so relax. Try to bite me one more time. Yeah. Relax, okay? Just go where you need to go right now so that they can take care of you, and that's it. Can we push? Let's push. All right. Stop it! Stop it! Relax. Ah! Can you pull this? Can you pull a bed back? Hey, this is looking bad for you, dude. Keep resisting us, okay? You need to relax. All right? Get back on the gurney and relax. I'm dying. Right, not dying. You're in the hospital right now. Ah! Listen, you need to stop biting him. All right, you want to just show charges against you, so please stop biting. Do you understand? Put that over his face. Push him back down to the thing. Hey, dude. I want you to take this off. We're going to grab his feet. Go hold on. Strong, dude. Hold this on. is to stop him from spitting. Just, just hold him there until we get more, guys. Watch your hand. Ryan, you need to relax, dude. You're just huh. causing more problems for yourself right now. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Toddling around his face. Spitting and biting. Just relax. Alright? Stop biting the officer. Yeah. You understand? Mm -hmm. Relax. Okay? I'm, I'm on my foot. <laughs> Ryan, relax. Let go. Alright? You need to relax. You need to start following our directions. Okay, okay, okay. Okay? Oh, wow. You're gonna start following directions? Yeah. All right, I want you to sit up. Okay. All right. Okay. okay. You're not going to win. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Why are you trying to make it all hard for yourself? Okay, okay, okay. All right. Due to the altercation with the cops, Goldberg began feeling the effects of his injuries as he eventually ceased resisting and followed their instructions. Watch his hand because he's, he's going to pinch off the hand. Okay. okay. Uh, put, him on the side. Gonna pinch off. put your left, left, left hand. Okay. Oh, no, no. Okay. Alright, okay. right. okay. sit up. Okay. Yeah, probably. Right. Yeah. Brian, you need to sit up. Brian, okay. get back on the gurney. Brian, you're about the gurney right now. Stand up if you can. Coming to jail. Yes, sir. I'll be in there. Okay, sit back. Brian, you need to sit back. Okay, come on. Ready? One, two, three. Get back. There we go. Alright. Brian, relax. Lay your head back, Brian. No more. No, no, no. Down. 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 Oh, like, you tell me so much. Okay. Alright. Thank you. Now, Thank you. let's try to strap him down. Thank you. Strap him down. You, you can do that. You can do anything you want. Yes, sir. Goldberg was charged with DUI two counts of reckless driving, and two counts of resisting a police officer. Don't miss out on thrilling stories about criminals. Subscribe to the channel for all the action.